Vanderwiele has indeed a very long history. The whole story about Vanderwiele started in 1880. That's about 136 years ago. In the time when the linen industry was very active, very dominant and popular in the region, in Belgium. So step by step, Van de Wille worked on the uh, agriculture machines, actually some kind of, it was not electronic machines or so in that time, but machines to help the farmers to grow linen. After several years, step by step, the linen industry moved eastwards went down but was slowly replaced by weaving industry. Most of the linen farmers started another activity such as weaving. So together with the farmers, linen farmers, Van de Wille developed weaving machines step by step. Till today Van de Wille is not only making weaving machines for carpet and velvet but also Tufting machines, finishing machines, extrusion lines, heat setting equipment, space diving, jacquard machines, feeders, knitting, many, many different machines for the textile machines and at home. That means today Van der Wille is not only selling machines, but they sell a whole solution for the textile industry. Inspired by expertise, as you can see on our website, on the brochures, on the mailings, uh, everywhere. There are two words in that team, inspired by expertise. The first word is inspired, inspiration, which of course is a very positive orientated word. You have to be inspired, there must be some kind of flame, some kind of energy coming out of yourself to be inspired to create new things. And to create new things, you must be an expert in something. Expertise is referring to expert, which means we were trying to make the customers clear that we are experts and inspired to create new things. If you turn back the clock five years, between five years back and now, a lot of things have been changed. Not only a few acquirements that uh, Van der Wille did, but also the expansion of the whole range of machinery. I give you a few examples. We started with tufting machine production by acquiring cobble to start with. From scratch, we started with building and developing and commercializing the extrusion lines for BCF yarns for the carpet industry. Recently, about a year ago, a year, year and a half, we started with uh, heat setting and space laying machines by acquiring, by means of acquiring Superba, other companies, so many such as harness builders and so, how does it continue? Let's say we approach the market now not only by selling separate machines on their own islands, we approach the market with complete solutions, with complete production lines. Sustainability, that's one of these words with a lot of contents. I will try to make it quite simple, quite clear. In other words, sustainability for me personally and also for the company means to the future, we have to be sure we can further develop new machines more ecological, good for nature, automatically good for customers, for people, for everybody. So from this point of view, we have developed an awful lot. By, I'll give you an example, by putting much more electronics inside the machine, who is actually working only when the machine demands their activity. Compared to the past with the mechanical machines, half of the the mechanical parts were moving even if they were not needed to produce. Now, with the electronic control systems, only the parts of the machines work which actually have to work. And the other half, if it's not needed, is not working. In other words, less power consumption, less uh, worn out pieces. So, it's uh, as for the customers, as for us, a good thing.
first of all, Van der Wille is a company which builds an awful lot of different types of machines. Some of them are wearing or carrying the name Van der Wille as a registered brand name. But apart from this, we also have other brand names. I'll give you a few examples, apart from Van der Wille, which is very well known for the carpet machines, the velvet weaving machines, extrusion, finishing machines, smart grills, uh, axe mister machines, wire looms, that's all the brand Van der Wille. But commercially, we promote and sell our jacquard machines under the name Bonas, feeders under the name Iro or Roy, knitting feeders, Memminger, tufting machines, Cobble, etc, etc. Then you have others like Protechna, camera control systems, and so many more. However, to the future, we are linking all these different machines with each other. Perhaps you ever heard of Internet of Things? At Van der Wille, it is not just saying, it is actually working already using Internet worldwide to connect machines with each other. Not to let all the machines work separately, but by linking them together so they can communicate together. I give you a small example. Suppose a customer, well a few customers have a whole production line starting from extrusion, heat setting, space dyeing, weaving, finishing, tufting to the end of production. They have all the machines and they are linked with each other. Suppose some designer put some new designs, carpet designs in the machine, digital developed, created, sends online the design into the weaving machine, but the design has other colors, say 20% more blue, 10% less yellow, 50% more red, compared to what was already inside. This information is automatically linked with the other machines. In other words, the first machine, extrusion, knows, oh, now, for the common production, which is put in the system, I need more yellow. Extrusion can automatically start to produce more yellow BCF yarn and reduce the blue. So, this information is very interesting for all production and this gains an awful lot of time. Exchanging and putting the whole machine production line in link with each other is very useful, very effective, very efficient and can only produce faster, more efficiently, without, with much less waste, with much less stock for any product per machine because they are all linked with each other. The goals of it's a bit, I will give you more or less the same answer as before. Due to the fact we are now promoting and trying to, to show the customer that linking several machines in production line is such a big advantage to the future. This is actually my answer to your question. To the future, we would like to show the customers that they have to invest in line systems and solutions, not in separate machines anymore. Of course, if the customer wants to buy a machine separate, we can still supply, of course. But the huge advantage of linking all these machines together is the future for the customer. It's not only trying to convince our customer in textile, textile producing, we already do the same thing since a few years, five to ten years, in our own production and producing textile machines. A little example, if you have big volume of big machines, you need more foundry equipment linked with the foundry. Information has been is exchanged automatically. Automatically, the demand, the request to produce this or that product in the foundry is increased, will be adjusted. The whole part, some parts of, of machines 
have to pass several steps before it finished, this link to pass all these separate steps go automatically, fluently. It's not stopping after one part of finishing, then manipulation by somebody or by a robot or by a forklift or a person to the next step. No, it all goes automatically.